Welcome to the official Windows 7 channel. Um, one of the features that um, happens uh, since Windows Vista is the fact that uh, some of the uh, available software and especially when you want to tweak in your uh, Windows operating system um, some of those features were kind of sent to a lower um, user account setting and one example of that is the command prompt now for some reason you might one day need to use a command prompt to fix something in Windows or just to issue a special command the command prompt in Windows XP was pretty much administrative so you just typed what you wanted to do and it would do it in Windows 7 the command prompt by default is just a user command prompt so if you try to change um, properties in Windows with your command prompt it's gonna say you don't have the right to do it so what you need to do is what is called an elevated command prompt that is giving the command prompt the administrator privilege now, how you do that it's very simple just go into start pro all programs accessories and you'll see command prompt here now if you just click on it you've got a normal command prompt you can go and do all that you want an elevated command prompt means you'll go into the start and all programs and accessories and right click you'll right click on the command prompt and you'll say run as administrator you'll click that and it's gonna ask you do you really wanna allow the following programs to make changes to this computer and you'll say yes now you've got a full privilege command prompt. Everything you'll type here will actually work because the command prompt has the right to change all sorts of files in your Windows install now. So use it with care because now you can actually really screw up your Windows install. But it's the best way if you have to issue a special command if it's telling you you don't have the privilege to do it or if it's telling you you need to be an administrator to do it then just right click on the command prompt run as an administrator and you'll have the full privileges and generally what you couldn't do before should work from now on if you enjoy our videos click the subscribe button and you'll be informed of new videos online if you have any comments or questions on what you've seen let us know and we'll try to uh, answer any questions. If you have a feature of Windows uh, 7 that you'd like to see reviewed, let us know and we will try to uh, put online a uh, video to explain. And hope you come back to the official Windows 7 channel. Bye-bye.